Hey everyone, let's learn how to install a Japanese keyboard on your Android phone. First, let's go to settings and then we're going to scroll until we see um, language and input. We'll tap on that and then we're going to click on Samsung keyboard, multiple languages. Let's tap on that add input languages tap on that and then we're going to scroll down until we see nihongo japanese nihongo tap on that to download it it's going to take a few seconds before it's downloaded so let's just wait bam it's downloaded now let's test it open our notepad Alright, and to know you can see the keyboard is still the English version. To change it to Japanese, all you do is just swipe to the right. So you change it to Nihongo. And you can just go ahead and type. So for example, if we want to write a Japanese word, let's write um, Genki. Genki. So it's um, K. And to get it to be gay yeah at the 10 10 right so you go here and then key now we have the kanji right here tap on that and that's how we type in japanese however if you want to use a japanese key keyboard but you are not comfortable with hiragana you may also use a different type so just now we use the kind of flick keyboard we may also use the top one here and let's see what happens again we go back to our keypad to our notepad we want to type see here the keyboard is in romaji or english and if you know how to spell Genki, it's G-E-N-K-I. See, we type in Romaji, but the hiragana comes up. And of course, you tap that to change it to kanji. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave us a like if you did.